Ellen do. Da such dann sie wie sich ne Eja. An durch na sie wie nit eben. Na has such dann dann sie wie sie nach dann dei. Iven. Isen de veno jo no hei dann dann. In dono ja no, dam such dam san hach. In de vene schenich dam ja. In toren an da vene ja ne no. Sandach vene, sandach vene, sandach ja. Nich soran ham, nich soran ham, ninde beno. Da sucht dann da asan hai, wie schach nakal ar asoch no. Ist wen, sagt dak ar asoch, ist du kanaya berga no, i vasha. I was a hum dum dum Ich 
is door tang tang it nan tang is so nai yen te esha nach tang tang as as asucht as ana ach asucht es evesiet as asut nan asivit en er tang so Sat Nam, thank you so much for joining. <clears throat> My name is Jean. I am a channel for Creator Consciousness to assist humanity in reawakening and re-embodying its divine core, authentic expression, which I believe to be the Christ that inner child, which is the emergence between the masculine and the feminine. I think obviously all my perception. So yes, thank you so much for joining. Thank you for being here. Thank you for, for connecting with me. Thank you for doing the work. And thank you for receiving. Today's session slash activation is intended to assist us in connecting with what is important, connecting with gratitude. Um, I recently went through a really intense experience. As I mentioned in yesterday's video, um, it was because I was actually kind of ignoring. Um, I wouldn't necessarily say perhaps ignoring, but I wasn't, I wasn't really seeing exactly what Creator was trying to, to show me, right? Um, and so I, I had to have a tower moment, etc. But this tower moment has been teaching me so much. Um, because for the first time in, like, for the first time in my life, I can truly say that due to the 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 growth that i have gone through due to um the healing i have done and due to my knowledge and relation with creator my knowledge of and relation with creator my knowledge of creator due to my relationship with creator right i've come to notice how even this really intense tower moment is a completely different experience within me and and from my perspective um and how i am truly truly seeing and feeling gratitude for something i don't even necessarily understand i'm saying gratitude because i'm obviously not happy that the thing happened or whatever right but gratitude because it is really forcing me it is truly truly forcing me to basically just be happy with what i have it is forcing me to be grateful for what i already have what i already know um, it is forcing me to be accepting and 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 gracious about where I am not like physically but like physically but spiritually emotionally etc right and it is truly actually just such a humble experience and that is what I want to share because I have noticed <clears throat> with with all these intensities when we carry these intensities these densities etc right when we carry the, 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 the energy of acceptance, of um, allowing, when we carry the energy of <sighs> gratitude, gratitude for simply being, gratitude for the sake of gratitude, gratitude because it is, it is our nature to be grateful for simply existing because it is our natural state to live in a state of, of joy and bliss and gratitude, right? But when we carry that energy, the more we actively on our journey choose to cultivate that, the more I am starting to see that the densities and the extremities that we experience are so easily washed away simply by taking a breath and choosing to be grateful, simply by taking a breath and choosing to be um, happy with where you are and what you have. Now, I'm not saying that we aren't allowed to want. I'm not saying that we aren't allowed to um, want to improve. We aren't allowed to um, want to have more. Of course not. That's the whole point of existence as well. You know, otherwise there won't be growth. Otherwise there won't be expansion and um, innovation, etc. Because like these things happen because we want more and we want better, etc. And there's nothing wrong with that. But when we when we when we try and manifest the moreness and the bitterness from a space of already gratitude and we all know this everybody in the spiritual community knows about gratitude okay but i don't necessarily think everybody always understands the actual power of it and the reason why it's so important when we manifest from the space of having gratitude the the things that we are manifesting will manifest faster 
um, they will manifest differently and more ease due to our 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 energy being at ease and 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 at a faster vibration. And also, I feel like I feel like the energy of gratitude heals the frequencies that are hindering our 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 manifestation. I feel that gratitude. The reason I'm saying this, let, let, let me explain. I hope I'm not talking too here and there, okay? Because I'm, I'm jumping a little bit around. Energy is still a little, un poquito, um, like, um, frazzled, but I'm, like, getting there. I'm, like, really grounding myself and integrating, etc. Anyway, um, the reason why gratitude is so powerful is because I feel like gratitude in some way is an offset or, a, a, like, a branch um, off of acceptance, or, uh, like true, true, I'm talking, I'm not talking about acceptance, I'm talking about fucking acceptance, I'm talking about the acceptance of creator, I'm talking about the enlightened acceptance, like truly it doesn't matter what happens, like truly it doesn't, that kind of acceptance, right? Gratitude is like, is like a, is like a byproduct of, of, of that acceptance, because when we accept, when we are truly at peace with whatever is happening, no matter the good, the bad, the ugly, the beautiful, the fucking neutral, everything, we simply, we simply reconnect with this inner part of ourselves. We simply, we simply um, naturally start feeling grateful for the simplest things because once again, that is our natural state. We start when we when we start accepting when we start truly accepting everything for what it is we start seeing everything that we already have in such abundance we start seeing the um the things around us that we that we that we might not have have noticed playing the biggest impact within our lives and our experience and our feelings the way we relate to everything right and yeah i just i just want to share this i just want to um, I just want to make it very clear that, so acceptance in some way equals gratitude, right? And gratitude truly, because acceptance also, but gratitude truly kind of just washes away dense energies. But it does require a level of complete surrender to Creator in order to be able to feel this gratitude, in order to be able to feel the surrender. And once again, I'm not talking about acceptance and gratitude as in like, okay, acceptance, gratitude. I'm talking, you know what I'm talking about. Why am I trying to explain myself? God. <laughs> so yeah, that is what I want to share. That is what I, what I want to bring forth. This gratitude is, 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 and, and just one last example, because this, this is such a clear thing that I'm sure a lot of people have, have gone through, right? When we go through a situation and it's like a, a blessing in disguise or whatever, right? When we go through a situation, we go through an, an, an intensity and we feel this, we, we, we choose gratitude or whatever. It's almost like gratitude shifts your perspective into a more positive one. Like you, you just start becoming more positive, which we are already at our core. We are already these grateful gracious, accepting beings. But the more we do it in an earthly 3D um, realm, in an earthly 3D experience, you know, like our active choice that we constantly make, I want to be grateful, I want to surrender, I want to, etc. The more we start seeing that all of the bad, all of the densities, all of the darkness that we experience as darkness is actually not that bad. And we start seeing the goodness um, like without the darkness, it's almost like that, you know, go what you wanted, lose what you had, or um, kind of like that, or you get put in a situation in order to see how good you truly had it already. It just puts things into perspective. But yeah, so that's what I'm sharing. That is what I'm gifting today. It's this just this sh super, super, super life-changing experience of gratitude, this life-changing experience of um, choice of gratitude. Because not only does this gratitude humble us, but it allows us to manifest so much more. It allows us to see things so differently. And when we see things differently, we just start living differently. We start living better. We start living in more joy, in more flow, etc., etc. Okay.
this is kind of a long video, but I thank you so much for joining. I thank you so much for connecting with me. Please remember to like, share, and comment on my YouTube channel if you feel like the medicine resonates. Also remember to contact me for a personal session if you resonate with my medicine in that way. And also please remember to donate for the medicine that you are receiving. Um, my PayPal's in the description box down below. I just want to say I've been receiving emails and um, not just emails, like comments and emails and of people simply like expressing their... Um, their gratitude to me, like their love, their, their, their like appreciation for what I do. And I cannot tell you truly how much that means to me. Like truly, and I, I, I know I, I say this so much, I keep saying this, but <clears throat> I truly, truly appreciate it so much. Like connecting with you in this way and realizing that I am making some sort of an, a, a, a difference in your life means the absolute fucking world to me um and i'm gonna go right now <laughs> also in regards to yesterday's video it's all about and this video is also like a continuation of that because it's a process right you're following my process we're in this process together etc it's coming back to basics it's coming back to the real true authentic core reason why I, i'm doing this and it's because of emails and comments like that or just people telling me like wow like I, like you're really helping me like I'm getting a little bit teary, truly, just thinking about it, because I know what it can feel like. And if I can make somebody feel a little bit less alone, if I can make somebody feel a little bit more heard, or a little bit more just to feel loved, that's what I want to do. <laughs> okay, Sadnam, thank you so much for joining. I love you so much. I'm sending you so much love and so much joy and so much abundance and so much blessings, truly. We are so loved, guys. We are so loved, so protected. Okay, just just a, a quick, quick, quick integration. Dann an einem Tag sach nach sich nicht den innig besser. Ich wünsch dir es ja nachher a Suchtuk ar 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 danach Satnam, I love you so much. Please feel free to contact me. I love you. Never feel alone. You are always loved. You are always seen, and you are always heard. Satnam, I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye.